Good morning, saints. Please stand for prayer. Today is the feast of St. Beninius. St. Beninius, please pray for all of us, and especially for those celebrating a birthday today. Happy birthday over the weekend to Claire Gassel, Mary Bono, Nicholas Cowles, Annika Jaworski, and Chandler Mogren. And happy birthday today to Nathaniel Hathrop, Anna Shabilsky, and Aidan Skinner. Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, you inspired Emperor Constantine to build the Lateran Basilica, to be the mother and head of all churches in Rome and the world. Grant, we pray, unity among us all Catholics worldwide. Together we pray. Heavenly Father, we praise you and give you thanks for the blessings you have bestowed upon us. Keep us accordant with truth and active in charity, as exemplified by our patron, St. Thomas Aquinas. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please join me as we honor our flag and country. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day, saints. Good afternoon, Saints. Welcome back to the Halo Midday Show. I mean, look at all of this. This is amazing. Today is Monday, November 9th. It's a pandemic. Today is the final day of the pandemic canned food drive. Fruity Friday was a little slower than Veggie Thursday, and before cans started coming in this morning, we were just at over 67,000 cans. The goal for today was to collect over 100,000 cans. In the standings, the freshmen are in fourth place with 4,130 cans. The juniors are in third with 15,023, just behind sophomores in second with 16,767. And the seniors are all but uncatchable with 31,238 food items for Catholic Charities of Northeast Kansas. But today could change everything. If we are going to meet our goal of 100,000 cans, any class could pull ahead at the last minute. Who will win? People who need food in Northeast Kansas, that's who will win. Thank you, Saints. We will bring you the final results from the studio tomorrow. This past Saturday, the Saints claimed our third state banner of this fall when boys soccer won their 17th state championship. It was an amazing 8-1 to blowout in the state title match against Mays High School. DJ White scored twice with Ethan Young, Matt Siebel, Caden Ames, Arquez Morissette, Mitchell Farrar, and Xavier Russell, each scoring one apiece. This is Saints Boys Soccer's 17th state championship and SJ's 115th overall in 32 years of St. Thomas Aquinas High School. Congratulations to Boys Soccer and all of this fall's state championship. There will be a final tryout information meeting for boys basketball tomorrow after school in the Ox Gym. Students, stop by the Alumni Bulletin Board located by the Counseling Office and check out two new Alumni Career Spotlights. The Alumni Career Bulletin Board is another way to connect with former SGA grads about career exploration. Networking and career exploring are great tools for gaining information about fellow saints and various careers. Our Alumni Mentoring Program is another fantastic tool to use in career exploring. Want more information about Alumni Careers and Mentoring Programs? See Ms. Mrs. Schreiber in the Advancement Office. Congratulations to Anna Schmier on being selected to the EC KMEA District Honors Bands. She is now eligible for all, all state auditions for the Kansas State Honor Groups, which take place in January. Students enrolled in College Now or Quick Step Plus through JCCC, listen up. The deadline to enroll and pay for your College Now or Quick Step Plus course is today. Look for detailed instructions in your Google Classroom and email. Campus Ministry prays a decade of the rosary every day after school in the chapel from 305 to 315. Join us. All are welcome. Today's Saint of the Day is Saint Beninez. Saint Beninez was a student of Saint Patrick and succeeded him as Chief Bishop of Ireland. Now it's time for the fun fact of the day. Did you know that the name for the shape of a Pringles potato crisp is a hyperbolic para paraboloid? <laughs> wow, that, that is amazing. I just did not know that. And very hard to say. <laughs> Thanks for watching today's Midday Show. We'll be back tomorrow with more announcements. I'm Elizabeth. And I'm Emma. Don't, Don't forget, forget, we'll, we'll find, find a way, way to make today, today great. great.